Hi, Dave here from Melbourne SEO Services. Just wanted to give you a quick update on something that Google's just announced. It's literally on the bleeding edge. This has only been announced uh, within the last 30 minutes or so. It's called Google Hotpot. And what it does is it draws on a lot of information from uh, Google Places and you know businesses and things like that and enables you through a new interface to be able to log in and rank and rate different businesses now the real key of what hop Pot offers is the ability then to see what your friends are liking and your friends are voting for so very much like at the moment now location based apps and programs online are really all the rage right now and especially with Google Places obviously the importance of really targeting uh, the search results based on where the user is and also what's going on in that user's own life you know a recommendation from a friend to say that hey this pizza store is a good pizza store is worth more to me than some random person voting for it so the integration of both location and also friends is, is really a big area that uh, the internet is shifting towards over on my blog davidjennings.com I did an interview with Eric Qualman and he's got a book um, that's called uh, Social Nomics if you haven't read it definitely worth reading but it's all about this shift and the way that things are going so this new Google hot pot I think is very much a, a great example of what's what's going to come down the, the pipe as far as really sort of focusing in on this and they've tied this whole hot pot together with uh, an Android app as well and obviously that's going to flow onto the iPhone as well. So if you imagine having this app installed, you're out and about, you've just had dinner at a place and you, you jump in and you review it and then your friends can see it. It doesn't have to just be food as well. It can be clubs, it can be accommodation, all that type of thing. And I, I think the real key here is if you're a business owner, you need to be making sure that you're logging in and actively managing the different reviews that are going out and, and encouraging people to write reviews views as well specifically if you know you're, you're in food if you're in things like nightclubs very service based stuff accommodation things where people are on the go and they're checking on their mobile phone they're the types of ones that are most important so pizzas are, are a really good example of this I've you know it's, it's so new I've only uh, rated a couple of things but uh, having a look at you know this restaurant Tai Tai which is in Victoria Street you know it's uh, it's cheap and it's um, you know quick and and the food's pretty good too so that's something that I've recommended so now I've given it the thumbs up and let's say you know I'll do pizza here again all of this data is being pulled from um, Google Places and it's just in a new interface and then that integration with the way that the friends are looking at as well so uh, crust here uh, I'm gonna put crust you know I've eaten it at, at crust uh, at the moment here so my reviews going to be um, uh, used to be good before it went and franchised now not so much okay and then you can basically you just you know food were you happy with the food were you happy with the service so the food I'm, I'm not I'll put a, a sad face there service uh, that was um, okay the atmosphere average and value average so like I, I can put in there and just do a little bit of a ranking now and that now will get shared with my friends people who are involved in that and, and could you imagine if you're out and about for dinner and you're looking for somewhere to eat if your friend recommends a place it's going to mean so much more to you anyway I think this is a, a huge step forward something that local businesses really need to start paying attention on uh, if you want to find out more about this type of stuff you can head over to melbourneseoservices.com